The year one for Kent Laster did not go how I think anyone really hoped. The Trojans didn't win a game in 2021. In fact, their closest defeat was by 18 points. It was a frustrating year for Laster to say the least, but that doesn't mean the Trojans weren't able to glean some valuable lessons. A lot from shared suffering, learned a lot from going through adversity together, uh, learning that, hey, uh, maybe what coach says, uh, what, what they're trying to do, maybe that works. You know, our way isn't working when, when uh, you know, maybe we're not as committed as we need to be. Now, last year said things really started to change back in December. Their numbers still aren't quite where they would want them to be, but the guys who are suiting up have really started to buy into the system and culture university is trying to build. They do have some key pieces to replace, like their one under center, but they're hopeful they can get over the hump and get a win this season. Um, I think last year was a lot of what to do. Now it's how to do it. Now we can be, we can hone in on some things. Uh, it's really fun to coach these guys because now we're able to do that. We're not wondering are they going to be here? Are they, you know, are they committed? They are. They're really committed, and um, that, that's what makes it a lot of fun to see the progress and and to see how they've changed over a year, year and a half. Some good news for University. Two other schools in their district also didn't win a game last year, so there are a few potential spots to squeak out a dub. Another one at home against Robinson week one as they look to start the year on a high note.